There is no bigger game in Spanish football, and they're certainly the two most successful teams with such passionate fans. Stay with us. We'll bring you all the action live from Catalonia as Barcelona face Real Madrid. Hello from the Catalan capital and one of the world's great cities, Barcelona. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Spanish top flight, La Liga. It's Barcelona facing Real Madrid. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. Well, this is what we think for Barcelona. Marc Andre Ter Stegen in goal. Frenkie de Jong plays with Sergio Busquets in central midfield. And the starting role on attack today is handed to Robert Lewandowski. Modric. Oh, good defending to stop a decent looking attack. You can't really discuss impact players without discussing Robert Lewandowski. Well, he's the most creative player on the field. He can run with the ball, he can get himself out of tight situations, he can see a pass, he's very creative with his play. I think he's going to be the outstanding player today. Tempele. And he might be through here. And he didn't hesitate. Good thing, too. Well, he's so quick off his line. That's great goalkeeping, you have to say. An important interception. Fati. Aurelien Chouameni. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Pedri. Frankie de Jong. Tempele. Just look at his strength here. He holds off the challenge, he keeps his balance and he finds the back of the net. It's a wonderful goal. So the action continues. Will there be a quick response from Real? Benzema. This is Kroos. Aurelien Chouameni. Modric. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Ronald Araujo. Now Jordi Alba. And Barca moving the ball with purpose. Well, clattered away. Opportunity it is. And he's broken free. And it's in. Beyond the goalkeeper, Real Madrid on level. Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick, but he's still got so much work to do. Just look at the strength he shows to hold off the defender and still get his shot away. That's a really good finish. Golden. 
So underway again, following the goal that made things level. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Modric. Now with Benzema. Well, a foul, but the advantage with Real Madrid. Opportunity in the wide area. How to play Real Madrid throw here. Could cross it in here. And the ball sailing over everyone in the centre. Vinicius Jr. Vinicius! Well, we really have to call that a squandered opportunity, Stuart. Well, what a waste that is. It's far too easy for the keeper. He should have made him work harder there. And smart defending. Lewandowski. And offside anyway, albeit a tight one. And one minute of stoppage time has been added on. Tony Kroos. Benzema. Well, the first 45 minutes have come and gone here in Catalonia. Underway then in the second half. And the two teams matching each other just about stride for stride. A very good tackle. Benzema. Busquets under the cosh. Well, he has plenty of battle scars and he knows how to lead a line, Karim Benzema. It's going pretty well oh, for him. What a chance this is. Nicely saved. Dembele tasked with taking the corner. Well, they've lost possession of the ball. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Oh, just narrowly off target. Well, they broke with such pace and intent. Fantastic move, just couldn't quite cap it off. Lewandowski De Jong that's how to blunt the edge of the opposing attack and tidily play well they've given him too much space it might be the moment to get them ahead well that's really sound goalkeeping not letting the opposition have any scraps might be able to set up the chance the replay and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back and then Lewandowski's finish is brilliant he strikes the ball so cleanly and gives the keeper no time to react it's a really good goal so the game has been restarted what sort of response will that elicit from Real Madrid now, who can he play it to well that's a really good authoritative tackle throw in here Vinicius Junior. 
What can Real do from this position? Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. A terrific pass. And it goes! Two goals in rapid fire fashion and looking very comfortable here. Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. So back underway at 3-1. Tony Kroos. Aurelien Chouameni. And fed forwards. And it all counts for naught. And a throw in it's going to be. And time for the change now. Modric. Benzema. Now Azar. Must be. I'm putting it wide from there. A pity, really. Can he finish? Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. And they're making a change. And fired over by Kroos. Well, as a defender, that will suit you down to the ground. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Must be! There's the goal! Surely now, that is that! Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive, but the keeper should do better in his near post. That's gone in far too easily. That's not good goalkeeping. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Vinicius Junior. Another successful intervention, winning the ball back. Frankie de Jong. That's not a bad ball. Missing the target by a tiny margin. Well, it's a difficult skill to get right, but he almost pulled it off there. He made such good contact with the ball. Well, the electronic board lets the fans know. Three minutes of stoppage time. Oh, a lovely ball. Well, what an opportunity squandered. Far too easy for the keeper. The final whistle has sounded, and it's a victory for Barcelona. Well, it was a very assured performance, wasn't it? I was particularly impressed with their play going forward. Really lively, almost cutting through at will at times. The result was never much in doubt, if I'm honest. But it just seems in this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, he gave that back line a torrid time, didn't he? He was far too sharp for them, always looking to play on the shoulder, took his goals well too. Clearly the difference maker today.